<laughs> Look at her. She's like stealing the bowl. Yeah. You don't need all that. <laughs> it's too sweet. <laughs> Stumpy? No. You're going to get my leg all muddy. Why? Yeah, he's like, what else? What else can I get into? <laughs> okay, put it down. Okay, ready? Ready? Go get it. Good morning and welcome to the Ten Acre Woods. My wife Tara, my name is Mark, and uh, the animals don't quite know that we're on our way out to do feeding. So uh, you might get uh, a good example here of oh, no, everything that goes on. I think they, they hear. <laughs> good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Coco. Mind you, there's lots of water in the ground. Yeah, it rained last night. We got some uh, much needed rain. Good morning, Petunia. So the kids have another two weeks, I believe it is. The 8th, 8th of July is uh, when they are heading out to their new homes. Um, last video we did take and put the mamas on the other side of the fence. You'll notice they're back in here. The crying and screaming was uh, kind of pulling at our heartstrings, so we... <laughs> We gave in and we uh, we brought the mamas back in here. <laughs> it's fine if uh, the kids go off yard and then the moms can't hear or see the kids and vice versa. And it's uh, it's pretty quick. So yeah, it looks like we got some uh, rain in our um, trench. Heads out that way. And then down to a low spot. Yeah, All right. go that way. I just want to fill their water, duck water. Okay. The new ducks. Yeah, so we got two new ducks, uh, Donald and... Dale. Dale, right. Donald Donald's the, the white one. Nope, Donald's the tufted. Oh, oh, I thought the, the white one was the tufted for some no. reason. So, um, we believe they're not pure runner, but they are, uh, they appear to be a, a cross. That long neck kind of suggests that they're runners. Hi boys! <laughs> so they uh, came in, the owners um, I guess started traveling a bunch and they didn't want to leave them Well at they home. were, they had them with chickens yeah. and they were of course two boys and they want to, they were beating up the chickens. Yeah. Well and they were in a small area so they got yeah. here and they didn't know what to do with the large open space. <laughs> <laughs> Morning Fernando, Sheldon. Sheldon, did you like it? Hey? Yeah, so we built this uh, contraption here. And Amadia, which is the, um, the tan colored small goat, baby goat, uh, she was all over this thing. Back Sheldon, and forth look. and back and forth. We're thinking about in two weeks, once the kids are gone, we um, may move this into the main area. Because uh, I think the sheep will um, will enjoy the ball anyway. Hi. Good morning. Mm How's -hmm. my boy? Morning, Hi, Billy. morning, Billy. On your favorite rock, I see. <laughs> and there's Levi and uh, Meadow out in the distance. Yeah, they do have lots of grass up front. So they've got a nice blend of... Uh, a fresh grass and then of course some dried hay. Oh, it looks like we have a tin can. Yeah, Did that just that. come out of that one? No. Oh. <laughs> yeah, the uh, things you have to watch for when you get um, ditch hay, we call it. Jenna has been saying there's a mouse here every day when she's... Yeah. So these, uh, this is where we put our grain in these bins. We put this cover on, but we sometimes get a little mouse that uh, gets caught in here. Right. Uh, so this is wheat, and this here is barley.
distract them before I go to the barn? Yeah, so they're not all at the door in the barn. The alpaca, uh, you can see Jasper. <laughs> Jasper over there. And I can see another white one looks like uh, Juanita. So now it's coast is clear. What do we got, eggs? Ah, somebody's hiding. Those Muscovy? No. No. The Muscovy eggs, you can tell because they're waxy. And green. And more like green. Yeah, off-colored. Pigeons. So uh, there's the uh, feather-footed, one of the feather-footed pigeons. And then we looked last week, and uh, we looked at these guys. Now they have their feathers. And the one of them, uh, not that one, it's the other one. No, I'm not feeding you. Oh, are you fighting me? <laughs> what, what are we doing? This one here has the feather feet. <laughs> hey, where's your mama? Where's your mama? <laughs> uh, all oh, right. Shut that door. Um, one thing I've noticed here, oh, we've got a green light coming up. Uh, we had rain last night, so whenever it rains, you can get um, arcing off of the um, electric fence uh, to ground. So it's just in the green. It's still good, but uh, we'll keep an eye on that. It's probably weeds at this Yeah, it's grass. probably because it's just damp out there. So it's still shocking through the uh, weeds. Um, we uh, do um, offer a discount on Gallagher products. So they are one of our um, sponsors. Uh, so if you are interested, I'll leave the link down in the description. You can get 10% off uh, any Gallagher management products. Up two by two. <laughs> Hi guys. <laughs> All right. So last night uh, should have. Yep. So whenever we're done feeding, we uh, we set up for the next the next day, the next I evening. I left my pail in there. I gave them peas and lentils yesterday. You guys made a mess of them though. Jeez. Could eat those. <laughs> Uh, uh, so we cleared out the um, the hay barn uh, down our driveway and stocked everything up in here. Uh, so it's now ready for the end of. Uh, is it the end of June or July? He's bringing it June, isn't it? Yeah. So in the next week. Yeah. So six. Well, probably three hundred bales of hay a time. All right. I can hear Petey and Piper out there too. <laughs> uh, is there food down? Yeah, but I have to get uh, for for the Charlie's gonna freak out. So yeah. get Charlie's uh, food. You want me to let them in and you go out? Uh, once I get Charlie's food from behind you. Oh, you don't have it yet. Well, Thought you had it. Greens. I got his food, but all right. All right. So Blackie's out there. So are the pigs. They don't need to eat. So that'll we'll just do that later. Just Charlie we can hear. Hey right, Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie. <laughs> Charlie, okay. I got it. Here. Is this what you want? Yeah, here. Right here. There you go. Okay, Blackie's Onyx. Blackie. Onyx and Star. Oh, 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 Star. Yeah, she, oh. <laughs> she, she locked up. <laughs> Turn around. There you go. 
gonna start. That's right why now. she's so chunky. Yeah. <laughs> she loves this stuff. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Look at her. She's like stealing the bowl. Yeah. You don't need all that. <laughs> it's too sweet. <laughs> she, <laughs> she's trying to milk the... Uh, <laughs> she likes on it. Well, she's she's small, too. She's smaller she's uh, than her chunky, sister. But she's though. She's, she's getting chunky. <laughs> <laughs> just a hog there. Uh, little nugget. <laughs> <laughs> chunky. You don't need that much, though. Uh, Come here. Onyx Come is here. cleaning it up pretty quick. <laughs> oh. uh. Hi. <laughs> she had butts earlier. Find the hay. She's chunky. She's good weight after being. Are you guys out in the rain? Hi, Blackie. Hey. Yeah. Looks like Juanita was. She's pretty wet. This is Pedro here. Oh, she's he's he's always she's the first young. one done. She's gonna go check to make sure Blackie's oh. bowl's empty. Yeah, she's gonna check the bowls. <laughs> uh, Monix is gonna go check the other yeah. bowl. Come on. Whoop whoop whoop. <laughs> Turn the head. Turn the head. There you go. Good the, girl. The sheep follow their head. Okay. She's so chunky. <laughs> go eat the hay. Oh, here comes Turbo. Okay. How Pacas can come up. Alright, Paca. Let's go. Oh. Uh, Turbo's probably yeah. gonna come in, Turbo, so come we gotta get him out. Here's gonna take some grain. All right, guys. Okay, that didn't work. <laughs> oh, there's Juanita. I thought you were. Oh, that must have been Java or a Jasper. I don't know. They all look. Uh, they all look the same when they were dirty, dirty white and dirty. <laughs> Unless she changed positions. <laughs> all right, Jasper. Oh, that's no, that's Shanzi. Come on, Shanzi. Let's go. Should have known. You two girls stick together, don't you? Oh, pig food's down. Oh, oh, the pigs weren't in. Oh, yes. <laughs> Turn the bowl off of it. Uh, give me that, you pig. You think you're a pig? <laughs> Paula. Paula. Okay, turbo. Yeah, he's like, he's scarfing it down. <laughs> yeah. Uh, come on. <laughs> that's all. That's all there is, buddy. <laughs> yeah, he's like, what else? What else can I get into? <laughs> all right, there we go. Retry these. Petey and Piper. De whoops! Decided to uh, stay out. Eat out today. <laughs> well, I'm late. You're late. You're yeah. Out. You miss breakfast? Well, you gotta wait. And that kind of teaches them to come too. When yeah, they're... no. Food <laughs> talks, right? Right, Piper? Yes. We're late. Breakfast is over. Turbo ate your, uh, your meal. <laughs> uh. All right, guys, you, uh, you guys can go out to the, uh, the back where you normally hang out. Oh, hi, Pedro. You have a drink of water, I see. You're dripping. <laughs> okay, so it's a little mucky out in this area here anyway. Got our little stepping stones we kind of put on here. So there we go, the morning animal feed. It was fairly quick. Oh, pea fowl are, uh, oh, the peacocks have their tails up. Two of them anyway. Tara had mentioned that one of the pea hens is sitting. So, I'm wondering if she is inside that building there. I can see one pea hen over here. Let's see. Hmm. 
Oh yeah, there she is in there. There you are. You gonna have some babies? <laughs> so you can really get an idea as to how well the animals clear the ground. Uh, so this uh, is the electric fence. And of course, this is what our property used to look like. Thick and green. But, um, but yeah, they've done a really good job. So if you're uh, buying property and you want to clear, this is the way to do it. <laughs> uh, so as I was mentioning about the electric fence, uh, everything's kind of wet and damp. And you can see there are, you know, sections where leaves are touching the electric fence. Uh, it's not too bad when they're dry, but when you get some rain, uh, you get a little bit more uh, connotivity between the leaves and the, uh, and the ground and the wire. And so, there it is. The duckweed is in full bloom. Uh, and we do have a turtle. So, just trying to see if I can spot it. Uh, what had happened was um, Tara actually found it in her garden, which is the strangest area because it's all fenced in. So we don't know how he got in there. He or she got in there. Uh, but I'm not seeing. Sometimes you'll see what appears to be a rock. Uh, and it'll be the, uh, the turtle sitting on a... Um, sitting on a rock but sometimes uh, during the uh, the sunny day though the turtles tend to uh, hang out along this edge and sun good morning stumpy yes stumpy only has one foot uh, so he was he was born that way but that doesn't uh, stop him from, at times, trying to challenge me like he's doing right here. <laughs> it's never ending, isn't it, buddy? What? What? Come here. You want to cuddle? You want to cuddle? Hey? Yeah, Fernando, you help me out. <laughs> uh, don't turn your back on that one. Walk backwards. <laughs> Uh. All right, there we go. I got a camera in my hand. It can be sometimes challenging to uh, to catch them. Sometimes I uh, sometimes I get them. All right, so here's uh, Mac Mac and her little ones. Yes, yeah, still very protective, aren't you? Yes. <laughs> All right, well. Uh, and then we have the other one. So the uh, pecan, which uh, stands out above the crowd. <laughs> and the little rowans. And you can see the third one in is a gosling. So the last couple weeks has been uh, relatively busy with, um, with birds coming in. Um, so goslings and ducklings and... Um, People are hatching them out and either they're running into some issues or uh, on a couple of occasions uh, they've had uh, a fox come in and take mama. So of course they're not quite set up yet so they, um, they don't have the means to protect the young um, from, uh, from the fox. And they're just, you know, they're just small, so they, they need a, uh, a mother figure, which is what the Pekin has been <laughs> over the last few weeks. <sighs> nope. There we go. <laughs> they, took, they took the shortcut, which wasn't so short. <laughs> Sonny! Sonny's been hanging out in here. So he was out in the other uh, area with Fernando, but... Uh, have you had enough of Fernando? Yeah. You know, the superstars can be tough. They cast a broad shadow, don't they? <laughs> uh. 
Stumpy? No! You're gonna get my leg all muddy. Why? Why must you do that? <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Why must you do now my of course now my shorts are dirty. Why? You know, you don't do it to visitors. Yeah. It's not gonna work for you. And you just give up. It's one thing, they're very persistent. <laughs> Did I get oh it looks like I got a little a little bit of mud even on the camera lens. Hey, why don't you go eat some grains? Here, go out. Go out there. There you go. Go eat some grains. He's the only rooster around here, other than Henry. But Henry's pretty chill, so I guess he figures he's alpha and he's gotta, he's gotta take us on. <laughs> right, Fernando? <laughs> Charlie! Charlie's got his grains. We had uh, uh, farm yoga yesterday. We used to call it goat yoga, but all the animals go into the yoga session. And uh, I think we had about um, 15 to 20 people yesterday. And of course, Charlie wandered in there and everybody hooed and hawed over our cute little Charlie. <laughs> uh, but once there's grain on the ground, you don't get much, um, much conversation with these guys. <laughs> So here's Amadia here. And this is CJ, little Carl. Carl Jr., I guess. And he was, uh, he was banded two, what was that, two weeks ago. So he's still, um, he still hasn't dropped. So he's still got his package there, but usually it takes, um, I don't know, anywhere three to four weeks. Uh, and, uh, and then one day it will be gone. Of course, he was the only boy, so the other ones are girls. Uh, so this one here is Star's sister. So I don't know, you know, Star's not here at the moment, but I don't know if you can compare any difference. She is probably about a third the size larger uh, than her sister, aren't you? Yes, I guess that's uh, what Mama's milk does for you rather than the powdered milk, right? <laughs> Where is Star? Probably in here. Yeah, there she is. She's got her head in the hay. <laughs> Star, why don't you go out and play? Hey, you're, you're such a loner. That's the problem with um, raising, bottle raising goats. So, you know, we had to bring her inside because she wouldn't have made it otherwise. Um, but, um, of course, reintroducing them and um, getting them to learn to be a goat. Yes, you are a goat. You're not a human. You're not our baby. <laughs> Unfortunately. You got your little uh, horns coming in. Don't ya? Yeah. Yes. Okay. You go continue to do what you were doing. Are you going to come out? You coming out? No? Are you a silly boy? Are you? No competition in this pen, right? You're the man. <laughs> and here's Edgar, our one rabbit that we have on yard. Uh, all the other rabbits we found homes for. Uh, but uh, Edgar and Henry are two of the, uh, the more special ones. Henry's been around for years. He's pretty chill. Uh, this is Edgar's, one of Edgar's favorite places is uh, getting in there and hanging out and sleeping in there. Hey, Henry, did you enjoy farm yoga too? Yes, you had lots of pictures taken with you. <laughs> so, Toby, I trimmed a couple, well, it was about a month ago. And, well, of course, Atlas doesn't need, doesn't need trimming. <laughs> He's a Bernese. Um, but I finally got around to, where is she? I finally got around to Maggie. And uh, she now is all trimmed up. Maggie! Yes, hi! What are you doing? What are you, what are you looking for? 
What are you looking for? Oh, oh, oh. Atlas. <laughs> what do you want? Do you want to play? You want to play? You don't play with toys. What you do is you chase Toby around when he has a toy. Do you want me to throw that, Toby? Can I have it? Yeah, yeah this is the game he plays with me. Okay, put it down. Okay, ready? Ready? Go get it. <laughs> Atlas, you're so funny. <laughs> uh, good boy. <laughs> Yes. Can we throw it again? Okay. This isn't your ball. I don't know where your ball is, but... Ready? Okay. <laughs> so I'm out here in the garden. If you haven't seen Tara's videos, uh, she's putting out a video once a week, uh, during the week. Usually it's towards the end of the week, uh, Thursday, Friday. Uh, so check out those videos and see how all this stuff is coming along. Uh, if you're not subscribed, uh, please do so. We're just closing in on 40,000 subscribers, um, which is a nice round number. Uh, I think we're only about 90 away, so we could do that within this week. Uh, anyway, that is it for this video. If you liked it, please uh, click on that thumbs up button and uh, join us here on the Ten Acre Woods. Till then, have a wonderful week and we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.